Hello viewers, so um, today I want to show off um, my set of Baofeng radios. Now, um, I just got this one. Um, this one is also new, like I got it just a few weeks ago. And these two are my original ones that I've had for a few years. Now, these ones, um, there are some differences actually between these two older ones and this newer one, and I will explain that in a minute. So this is the this is the one that I just got today. This is the UV five R plus. This is my first UV five R plus. As you can see, it is slightly different from the UV five R. So as you can see, here's this one, and this one is a bit different. Not totally different, but a bit. Um, uh, so, um, one thing I will mention about these is evidently these battery clips are very easy to break. Um, as you can see, this one broke almost immediately. And this one has been broken for a while. Um, this one, I'm not going to mess with the battery that much, so, yeah. And this one actually just got a new battery because the old battery casing had started to fall off and stuff, so, because I think it had been dropped a bunch. Probably because it was on this one. So anyway. Um, so... Sure. This is the box for this guy. Very practical box, I feel like. I'm trying to see, there. I know there's some typos on these. So I don't know if they mean high capacity or what um here but they put capability um anyway this is the one for the UV5R plus um I do think this is kind of interesting, some of the things they put on here. New beginning, um, humanized design, analog, Marconi, emergency, portable, keyboard, portable, er, no, emergency, portal, keyboard, portal, ambition, voice, help, FM, global vehicle, dual band, uh, multi-language, backpacker, uh, Amateur storage, light, FCC, driving, hot sail, antenna, New York, wide range, traveling. Um, Frequency Pro, programmable, fresh start. Um, some of these I find really funny though. Um, and of course that FCC thing is going to be important. This is the bottom of the box, as you can see. Not very, you know. So, let's turn these on. This one has not been, I have not run the program on this one yet. Um... Friday night, partly cloudy. 
a chance of showers and thunderstorms after so midnight. These, as you can see. Cumulative flows in the mid-70s. South winds 10 to 15 miles an hour with gusts up to 25 miles an hour. Chance of rain um, 30%. This one, Saturday, I don't have program. Mostly sunny. A slight chance of showers so. and thunderstorms in the morning. Then a chance of showers and thunderstorms now, the in the afternoon. Now the thing is with these. Um, Hot with highs in the lower 90s. Southwest winds 10 to 15 miles an so hour. So these two are older. This one is new. But brand new. So, evidently within the past few years, they made a change that I did not know about that, I don't know if it was the FCC or what. Oh, let me switch these off. So... Um, these two have the full transmission range applied to them. This one does not. This one is actually restricted a bit more. So, I don't know if it was a rule change or whatever with the FCC, but, um, these don't really have a restricted transmission path. This does. It can't go, I think, above 450 megahertz. I don't know what the exact range is. So as you can see, if I try to transmit, it denies me. And if I, whereas if I go transmit over here, I can do so. Test one, two, three. Um, so I don't know if this is, so this one can't broadcast on any of the like, GMRS or anything like that. These two can. I don't know what prompted that change, and also this one can't as well. Now, I don't know when that rule was changed with the FCC between me buying, getting these, and then these two. Um, I don't know what year I got these in, but... So... But... And supposedly it's locked out in firmware. So, there's no way I can fix this. Unless I somehow get the firmware off of these guys and flash it over here, but I don't think that's a good thing to do. So it's just going to be left how it is. So anyway, um, and, this, and again, this also applies to this guy too. Um, this guy also has that same restriction as this one right here, because, yeah, I don't know when the rule went into effect, but... Now you can listen to all the frequencies available, but you can't broadcast on them. Uh, on these ones right now, um, I do have um, VHF restricted because in reality there's no reason why I'd be transmitting on VHF to begin with. So that one's turned off, but yeah. Anyway, um... If you enjoyed this video, you can uh, leave a like, uh, comment, and subscribe. Um, thank you for watching, and have a good day.